Hello Scorpio, welcome on my channel, Triple Two Tarot. This is your girl TM, and uh, I'm going to do February 2020 monthly love reading for my Scorpios. You can switch the energies if you're a cross watcher. You can also come to me for personal reading if you want to. Check out the description box for prices and detail of the reading. Contact me on my email address if you're interested. You can also join me on Instagram and Facebook for more fun of reading. So let's see who is coming to you. What is happening in the month of February for my Scorpios? Let's find out. Let's find out what happened in your recent past. Okay. So you weren't stuck uh, with someone like you were having a hard time to let go of this person. Uh, you also have some type of uh, conflict with someone. Could be an air sign, Gemini, Libra, Aquarius. Like some type of... Uh, I'm feeling uh, some type of conflict and fight with someone. Oh, wow. So this could be your ex. Okay, you unblock this person because you wanted to talk with them. Or, there, or it could be uh, someone from your past, like, came back to you for talking. They, they, could, be, um, they could be unblocked you. And they, they wanted to talk with you. I feel that you moved on from this person, but this person came up towards you. Or it could be possible this is your energy. Like you're having a hard time to let go of someone. You wanted to talk with this person. Like you're very angry with this person. Very. So let's see what is your current energy. What is happening in your love life? Who is coming towards you? I definitely feel like it could be another water sign is coming in your life. Um, it could be a Taurus. I'm also seeing some type of proposal is coming in your way. Someone is letting down their guard. They're trying to express their feelings to you. The, yeah, someone from your past, okay? Like you dealt with this person already. This person is holding back their feelings, okay? Um, and I feel like this person could be deceptive for some reason and you were frustrated because they were not expressing it or they were not making a move towards you. But finally, they are going to do it. I'm also seeing could be another Scorpio. Pisces are Cancer. I'm seeing Taurus very specially here. We have the Earth sign too. We have Fire. We have Air. We have all the signs here. But these signs are specifically here that I told you already mentioned. Okay. So yeah, I feel here. Um, look at this. The bottom of the deck. Eight of Cups. Reverse Energy. So yeah, this is someone from your past is coming back to you. They want to talk with you. Uh, I feel that uh, you could be moved on from this person. Still, this person energy is very present here like they are having a hard time to let you go they want to come back eight of cups um six of swords you are here they were um they did not let you go mm -mm, they did not they're holding on to you still look at this four of pentacles energy they're still holding on to this connection they're having a hard time to let you go but i feel here they're coming back to they could be came back to you in the recent past are they coming back to you in the month of february i'm telling you this is like the past that you have some type of connection with this person like soulmate six of cups or you have kids with this person okay this could be the father of your kids yeah i'm hearing it for some reason uh, this could be your childhood friend or you were uh, you know studying together your college friend or something but yeah you have memories with this person this person is coming back to you they they can't let you go they can't let go of these memories Six of Swords, you're, uh, you, this person is always thinking about you and about this connection. I feel this person really wants to come back. They're holding back their feelings, Four of Pentacles, they, they can't let you go. Nine of Swords, they're up at night. This is really disturbing them. This could be the fear that they feel like you will move on. Are you are moving on already? The Ten of Wands, okay. Uh, I feel here uh, this person have could be responsibilities. That's why they were not... I feel this person is carrying the burden that... Uh, they did wrong to you or they were not right for you at that time when you were together i feel here this person really want to express their love to you they want to they want to express they want to talk nine of swords if this person never talked to you never expressed it they want to express it now with this four of pentacles and nine of swords energy it's really disturbing them and also they can't hold it back too much because it's really tiring exhausting for them to hold back their feelings they want to talk okay and for some i'm also hearing uh, this person could be you know um but not ready at that time but i feel here now with this nine of wands reverse here they're, they're letting down their guards knight of wands reverse this person could be a player or you feel they played with your feelings in the past but yes I feel that this person has fear that you will reject them. That's why they're not making a move here. Uh, this person came up to you because we have the Knight of Swords, recent past, Seven of Wands, you were here. So this person definitely, um, you know, 
unblocked you? There's some type of conversation happened between you and this person. Are they tried to talk to you? Are they send you a message? Are you you received the email? Are you could be your friends told you that uh, that person was looking for you? You know something like that. But this person is officially like uh, physically. This person is coming back to you in the month of February. I'm seeing here. Okay, moving on, we have the five, page of cups. So the, uh, you definitely could have some type of age difference with this person. We have the king of cups too. Uh, I feel this person really wants to make uh, the movement. Okay, they definitely want to express their love to you. They have feelings for you and they want to make it. We have the hierophant, Taurus energy. So this person could be want to propose you. Like you can get the unexpected proposal from this person. Or if you're a single, you could be going to meet someone. Or you could be going on to some type of, um, you know, blind date. And yes, and you will feel like, wow, you have a chemistry together with the six of uh, cups here. Yeah, some of you definitely I'm feeling here. Some of you could be worried about your, uh, you know, about your job, financial problem with this four of pentacles. Really, really uh, financial. Or it could be some type of home problems going on, like some type of issues related to your family, related to you. Yeah, page of swords. There's a lot of um, spying going on. I'm also seeing communication. Some of you very worried about that if this person will communicate to you or not. But I feel they are coming. This is interesting. This is interesting. I'm seeing that some of you could be divorced with this person. Or in separation with this person, okay? Like you were married. You have two kids. One kid is with the dad and the one kid is with the mom. And finally, this person want to make to you and want to make a reconcile with you. Look at this. Look at this. In through separation or you could be divorced and this person really wants to come back to you. The, I'm seeing the father of your kids, to be honest. Look at this king of cups and with this page of cups. The father of your kid want to make things right with you. Uh, the other uh, person who, who, who make you pregnant and they want to adopt the kid. Like they want to make things right with you, with this hierophant energy. They want to commit to you. They want to commit to this family. They want to commit to these kids and with you. Something is there with the kids here. So yeah, I feel here you are detached from this person. This person is seeing you detached. Okay, not communicating to you. But I feel they are coming to you. They want to communicate. Or you could be really worried about this person. That if they will communicate to you or not. Vice versa, but I feel this person energy here that the masculine energy is going to make a move here. They will express the love. They will make the proposal. They will make their things. And with the hierophant here or with this energy, I definitely feel you're going to get proposal from someone. Or someone will ask you out. But this is like, uh, I'm seeing traditional proposal here, to be honest. Someone is ready to commit here, telling you. Because they're in love with the six of cups energy. They see you as their soulmate. Eight of Cups reverse. This this is that person who left or they left you and they they back. They back. Okay. So yes. I really hope it resonated with you guys. See you later in the next video. Go, bye bye. God bless you.